Alright people, welcome back to the card review. So, something, I said something about reviewing some Young Zing card in the last episode. I was wrong. I didn't, maybe I just made up another Synchro Master in my head. I swear they had another one. I, I don't know. <laughs> and I even searched it and I was just like, wow, okay. So they only have these three. I'm like, what the fuck? Where, where is this other Young Zing monster that I made in my head? I don't know. I don't know. Anyway. Uh, we're just gonna go right back to the Cyber Dragon thing uh, and review the other Cyber Dragon card that uh, the OCG that got for Cyber Dragons, which is totally fine, you know. Uh, and also to update you guys on, you know, what's going on with, you know, the whole live video of webcam duels, because I know you guys haven't gotten any, like, live videos as of late. Um, when it comes to webcam duels, I decided that the first deck I'm gonna start off with is Cyber Dragon. So, it's good that I go ahead and sit down and I review, you know, the Cyber Dragon Finny, and of course this card right here, Chimera Tech Rampage Dragon, to uh, pretty much to assure you that, yes, Cyber Dragons are gonna be on webcam duels. And the thing is, uh, just similar to how webcam duels did before, um, if the deck does well enough, I might consider putting it on uh, maybe daily duels, you know? Maybe as a possibly as a tag deck, possibly replacing normal pendulums. The deck, normal pendulum is good, but it's, I don't feel like it's strong enough to be able to carry a duel if my partner isn't using a strong deck. So pretty much with normal pendulums, because of how just, you know, how weak they are in comparison to, you know, like, you know, how how well Heraldic's been doing and how well Train's been doing, that literally uh, Stanzi slash Stu slash Holly have to be uh, using, you know, a deck that can, if hit, shit hits the fan and, you know, they wreck my pendulum scales and I can't do shit, they can pretty much carry the duel by themselves and, you know, sometimes that's just not possible. So, I, like I said, I was thinking about going ahead and replacing it with maybe Cyber Dragons, which I definitely believe is a deck that can, uh, you know, fight by itself if it has to, especially with Infinity. So, uh, like I said, if it does really well on webcam duels and, you know, I'm ready to go ahead and be like, alright, done with Cyber Dragons and webcam duels, now what do we do with Cyber Dragons while we go ahead and move the next deck onto webcam duels? Uh, I'll go ahead and decide that when the time comes, as long as Cyber Dragons does pretty well on uh, webcam duels. Uh, that being said, live videos. Live videos is still just really rocky, you know. Uh, at this point, it seems like everybody's quitting Yu-Gi-Oh, you know. And if I didn't have my YouTube channel, I would probably quit Yu-Gi-Oh as well, you know. Uh, it's just not the game that I grew up with. It's not fun. I really don't have any card decks. I I have fragments of decks. You know, I have a little bit of Constellars, a little bit of Evil Swarms, a little bit of Tower Knights, a little bit of Yubel, but none of them are complete. And And, and right now... Right now, at this current moment that this video is going up, I do not have the money to be spending to complete any of these decks. You know, I had the money, I had to pay for college, I had to pay to fix my computer, and, and you know, it's just, I'm, I'm, I don't have the money. I do not have the money to go ahead and complete those decks. And, you know, some of them might even be just little bitty cards, but, you know, it's just, I, I don't, you know. And I'm not going to go ahead and, and, you know, try to be like, oh, well, you know, donate to my PayPal and, you know, and get me to go ahead and buy Yu-Gi-Oh cards so I can give you guys video. I'm like, no, 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 no. You'll get, you'll get the deck. I'll finish them eventually, maybe. You know, that's the thing. And even if I did have the money, I just don't really have, you know, ah, I don't even know what the word to use. You know, just the, the will to even really play Yu-Gi-Oh! in real life, you know? I, you know. I know you guys are getting sick and tired of seeing that Fire King deck, but I to tell you the truth, I mean, besides, you know, Fonzo's Fire King deck and Rennie's, uh... Uh, 100 deck, and there's really no deck that's really complete and ready to face those two decks or each other, and no one else is playing Yu-Gi-Oh! None of our friends are around that play Yu-Gi-Oh! No one, you know, is uh, into Yu-Gi-Oh! like that. There is no locals that's even close to us, nor do we feel like going all the way to the other side of town to locals. We don't feel like spending money on Yu-Gi-Oh! product and, like, going down to Walmart and doing openings. We just really don't feel like doing much of anything. So what I was thinking of maybe doing, which is, you know, at this point would just be like freaking ridiculous because I'm just blatantly just copying off of it's everybody, uh, is maybe just doing discussion videos, you know. I know I've done discussion videos in the past where, you know, like uh, me and my friend Ryan, who I haven't talked to in forever, you know, I think I think one week he invited me to a locals and I'm like, I don't got any decks, I'm not in Yu-Gi-Oh like that, I'm sorry, you know. I even was invited to be in that, you know, that Yu-Gi-Tuber dueling tournament, and I'm just like, no, I don't I don't want to be into that, and I'm just not in Yu-Gi-Oh like that, you know. I'm Yu-Gi-Oh Master, they probably expect me to, you know, walk in there with you bell and, you know, do something, and I'm probably not, and I'm just gonna get my ass beat, you know, so... I'm just not really into Yu-Gi-Oh! like that to even think about even joining in any kind of tournament, let alone, you know, something like that. But, uh, I was thinking about maybe just doing discussion videos, you know, just sitting in front of a camera, just like, you know, uh, you know, DPYGO or De Sigma or whatever the fuck he keeps on changing his freaking name to, I swear. I mean, he, he just, it seems like he just doesn't give a shit about his channel. He's just like, yeah, this is my username. Yeah, here's no, no card art. You know, I mean, no, no channel art, no nothing, no image, no profile pic, no nothing. 
So, but uh, I was thinking about just kind of doing what, like he does and just, you know, sitting in front of the camera and discussing various archetypes and things that are maybe going on, uh, you know, on in the game. And that could be your live videos, you know. It might take a little while for me, you know, to pile up enough things. And, you know, some might be, you know, taken right off of the cinema. Because sometimes, sometimes for the card reviews and stuff, I just look at the cinemas and I'm just like, what did he look at? Oh, he looked at this card. I don't need to look at this card. So, you know, if I'm just going to go ahead and, you know, look at the Sigma and see what he's doing, I might as well just go ahead and just do the whole thing. You know, I even took the freaking, uh, you know, card review is kind of like a little bit of Mega Capital G, a little bit of Sigma, you know. But, uh, you know, I t straight up took, you know, the under commentary for Mega Capital G. So, you know, screw it. So, you know, maybe we'll go ahead and do that for live videos. You know, it doesn't require me to do uh, any purchasing buying or playing of Yu-Gi-Oh I literally just have to you know discuss Yu-Gi-Oh and you know I'm I feel like I'm more of an intelligent enough player to go ahead and just sit down and uh, discuss various things that are going on in Yu-Gi-Oh because you know it's something more and above that card review you can do you know because card review I can sit here and be like all right this is Cyber Dragon Infinity this is Cyber Dragon Rampage but how does it work how does it come together you know so that's something that probably uh the, you know the, like the live discussions could go ahead and do so, I guess it'd be kind of like live reviews. I don't know. So, anyway, we're going to go ahead and look at Cyber Dragon Red Page, and hopefully I will go ahead and get webcam duels up, and hopefully we can just get back to the channel, you know, having that extra 11 o'clock video on Mondays, because at this point it's been two weeks, and I'm still just nowhere even close. You know, I put up that video, and you guys suggested decks, and I just need to start getting on it. So, anyway, this is uh, Chimera Attack Rampage Dragon, you know. So, it is a Dark Machine Fusion Effect Level 5, 2100 Attack, 1600 Defense. So, same stats as Cyber Dragon. The materials are two or more Cyber Dragon Monsters. Alright. So, a Fusion Summon of this card can only be done with the above Fusion Materials. Okay. So, you can't throw anything else in. It's got to be, you know, two or more Cyber Dragon Monsters. So, you know, you know, in the Cyber Dragon deck, there's a lot of cards that when they're on the field in the game, they're counted as Cyber Dragon. So, and of course, this guy is dark. So... Maybe we can get some of that, uh, that Overload Fusion that we haven't seen in a cool minute. You know, because I remember that. Future Fusion, one of the key reasons why Future Fusion got banned was just Future Fusion. Um, reveal, like, Chimera, Chimera Tech, because it really doesn't specify. You can just go ahead and say, oh, the machines, oh, the machines, oh, and then just go Overload Fusion, bam, Chimera Tech, game. You know, so, um, being able to go ahead and use Overload Fusion despite, you know, Future Fusion still being banned. But, uh, you know, just give you another card for Overload Fusion, because, you know, some people, you know, you might want to go ahead and throw Overload Fusion in there just for uh, maybe a uh, Chimera Tech over Dragon. But, uh, you know, sometimes you may not be able to uh, pull it off, you know, because there won't be enough machines in your graveyard, you know, it won't be worth it. But, you know, this guy only needs two, only two Cyber Dragons, you know. You get like a, you know, like a Zway and a Core, and bam, there you go. So, uh, let's go ahead and see if he's worth it, though. When this card is fusion summoned, you can target a number of spells slash shop cards on the field up to the number of fusion materials used for this fusion summon, minimum of one, and uh, destroy them. So, uh, that's pretty good. That's a pretty good effect. So, you know, if, you, if your opponent has, you know, st fat stacks of back row, and, you know, long ago got like a solemn morning or something to negate your effect, and you be like, alright, overload fusion, banish these five cyber dragons that are my cyber dragon esque monsters, because they will be cyber dragon graveyard. I don't need them anymore. Bam, summon this pop, 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 pop. So, there you go. I mean, that's a pretty good effect. You know, I love back row destruction. So, you know, this guy is looking pretty good. But he has another effect, too. Once per turn, you can send up to two light machine type monsters from your deck to the graveyard. All right. And if you do, this card gains one additional attack for each card sent to the graveyard by its effect during each battle phase this turn. All right. So send two light machine monsters. You know, there's, there's a handful of them. You know, a handful of them. Uh, definitely the deck that I made for the Cyber Dragons, there are more than just the Cyber Dragons that are Light Machine. So, you know, even if I don't want to send Cyber Dragon monsters, you know, if I'm like, oh, I don't want to send a Cyber Dragon, or I don't want to send, you know, like a, a Zly, I can send my other Light Machine monsters. And, uh, you know, that would work totally fine. Uh, you know, you could send, you know, like, Core, and then, you know, Core can go ahead and banish and summon you a Cyber Dragon, so that's a possibility as well. So, pretty much, again, addition... Just additional attack, so including this one attack, plus the other two, I mean, this card can do, what, 6,300 just by itself, you know, wipe your opponent's back row, attack for 6,300, I mean, that's not that bad, you know, you throw a limited removal in there, and you can go ahead and shake my goddamn hand, because, you know, that, that's very powerful, you know, and uh, maybe even, you know, with a little bit of power bond in your life, you know, just power bond, summon this guy, 
send to me, you know, double his attack, you know. I mean, he's going to be destroyed and you're going to take it, but if you can end the duel right then and there, like, you may, you might be able to pull something off, you know. It's not bad, not bad, you know. Uh, so, I definitely would recommend running this in the Cyber Dragon deck, and I'm definitely going to try it out. You know, I'm going to try out the Power Blast, I'm going to try out the Overlord Future, I'm going to try it out and see how good this guy is lined up next to uh, Infinity and see what we can do on webcam duels. Like I said, if it's successful, we'll go ahead and move the deck to our daily duels, the tag deck, you know? And No Pendulum is kind of like that filler thing. I, I mean, I really couldn't think of what deck to put there. I wanted to put something there, I just couldn't. And then, you know, I thought, oh, you know, Normal Pendulums, they seem fun, you know? The Mega Chaos seemed like he was having fun with it. Let's go ahead and try that out. But it's just not as a strong, it's not as a strong deck, you know? Uh, I didn't, you really don't think that that missing of the monster effects really wouldn't do much. But, you know, when I'm trying to be like, yeah, Royal Decree, yeah, fuck you, no back row, you know, you know, you can't play no back row, you really have to rely on the strength of your monsters, you know, it's a given, you know, you know, you know, Heraldics, they rely on the strength of, you know, ranking up and, you know, going to that, you know, 4,000 Utopia, uh, you can't target me with monster effects and you can't, you know, hit me with trap, with back row, you know, or, you know, you know, that's C101 or, you know, just, you know, staying up in resources, you know, train, summoning that door, so powerful, you know, that's a really strong beater, staying consistent, but, you know, uh, normal pendulum is just kind of like, oh, uh, you have a mo no you have a monster that's in effect stronger than any of my pendulums, and I can't exceed, and I really can't make, you know, first of dragons, oh, well, then I'm pretty much lose, you know, while other decks would be like, all right, well, you know, I can, you know, figure out a way to, you know, bait the effect, make a one-on-one, take them, you know, do something along those lines, run them over with a door or something, but, uh, normal pendulums really can't do that, but I definitely feel like cyber dragons so, are, you know, very powerful, very powerful infinity, and also this card being able to, you know, uh, wrap up the duel, or at least do a huge chunk of damage, especially in tag duels, uh, you know, might be worth it, you know, you know, uh, power bond, you know, I definitely don't mind my monster being destroyed and me taking, you know, 21 if I can fucking, you know, summon this guy at, uh, you know, 42, and then, you know, send two light monsters to have this guy attack three times for 42, I mean, come on, that's a huge chunk, you know, so, uh, you know, I'm definitely considering. I think this card is a really great card. I like it that you can use it with Power Bond and Overload Fusion. And I am looking forward to go ahead and seeing uh, what Cyber Dragons do in the OCG. I know they're top one, so, you know, Infinity is a very powerful card. This card is also nice. You know, uh, Nova is nothing to scoff at. And, you know, the Cyber Dragon deck is looking really nice in the OCG. So I'm going to go ahead and call up episode of card review. I have to get going. I'm probably going to be late for class because I did this video. Anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed. So thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And I will see you guys Next Tuesday with another card to look at. At this point, I'm not sure what card I'm going to look at, but I'll find something. And uh, like I said, I'm going to try to get webcam duels and hopefully uh, the live review slash discussion up as quick as possible. So we can, uh, you know, kind of iron out my channel. I feel really bad that it's not up, you know. I pride myself in being consistent and you know, having the content, but when I just don't have it, and I, I just feel bad. So anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed. So thanks for watching, thanks for the support, and I will see you guys on Tuesday.